my son Dre, my, my only child, my only biological child, Dre was really an ornery kid. He was a lot of fun. He had a great sense of humor. That was probably my very favorite thing about my son. He may have been seven years old and he told me this joke and it was really funny. He said, do you want me to tell you again? He just wanted, he loved making his mommy laugh and I loved that about him. It was around that graduation time frame that he started acting a bit off. He was just having a hard time. Dre turned 19 in July of 2012, and then he took his life the following month. So just a week before he was supposed to start college, he died by suicide. In the beginning, I was pretty sure I was going to die, not because I was going to take my life, but because I just couldn't imagine living with this weight. Dre used a gun to take his life. Half of all suicide deaths are, use, are people that use a firearm. And it's clearly a need for people to understand the importance um, of that and to approach the firearms community in a way that's collaborative and not a we versus they kind of a thing. We are not anti-gun, we're anti-suicide. And we need to work with the firearms community to make sure we have messaging out there. And I've met the most amazing people I've ever met in my life. And I'm blessed to be able to do this. And we want people that own firearms to understand they're not viewed as the enemy. And we really, we just wanna partner with them to save lives.